Sergei Kamara, who will be uh, mentioning his number a lot when he uh, is running the ball, is oh. actually kicking it off. It's a short kickoff. It goes up one of the off oh, men, no. and there is a scramble for the ball, and it's possible Watertown may have recovered. It looked like it went off of one of the Belmont up men. It went off of his left. Ryan Hoffman. Uh, down on it. Yeah, it was, it was originally it was a squibbed kick, and it went off of uh, number 55, Ryan Hoffman, and Watertown has recovered. Second down, and it's going to be another running play. And oh. a fumble. The ball is picked up, and on a fluke play, Mungay Kamara, although I don't Once again, Kamara to kick off from the 40, and again, it's LaFosse near side, Emmanuel Clark far side, back deep for Belmont. We'll see how far this kick goes. Well, it's squibbed once again, and it's oh, no. another I don't offense. believe it. That ball I is kicked up, it. and here goes Kamara. Kamara's got the ball, and he's going to be knocked out and of he bounds. Fumbles. Except he was out of bounds. It's second and goal. McDermott under center. He'll hand off, and that will be a touchdown for yeah, Andre with the point after. That thing has got to be like kicking a boulder today, but this time he splits the uprights. Kamara's still Nine. doing the kicking, so let's just watch this. I am guessing he's going to squib it again. No, now he's going to pop it up. And it will be fair. Oh, well, wait gosh, a minute. I don't believe the it. ball is loose. No. I can't believe this. Boy, this, this is uh, an incredible game plan that's worked. And of course, they had to win, the, they had to kick off to be able to do it. Oh, the pass God. to Kamara is complete, and it's going to be a touchdown. Today. And I, 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 I'm sure Coach Kakachi looked at it as the extra point is up and good. With 8.47 to go in the first quarter, it is now Watertown 20 and Belmont nothing. Let's see what Kamara's got up his. Uh, up his sleeve this time for a kick. It's going to be another pop-up. That is Rakai Joseph, number three back, and he went to a knee. I guess I'm not supposed to cheer. Well, you're I... getting the Belmont crowd here in Harris Field kind of employing a little bit of a Bronx cheer as the Marauders actually recover the kickoff. Rakai jo now it looks like uh, Rakai Joseph's in there. He'll take the pitch on second down. Rakai Joseph looking to try to get in the open field. He turns the corner. He heads up field. And Rakai Joseph is off. He's down the sidelines. One man still to beat. Feet. He is still going, and he will score a touchdown. It's definitely fourth down, and I, I think definitely the Marauders are going to go for this. Oh, yeah, you have to go for it. Yeah. Down 14 with under seven minutes to go in the first half, especially the way they're running the ball right yeah. now. Yeah. They've had success running the football today. Except they go with four wideouts. Interestingly enough, no, no Joseph or O'Connell in the backfield. Ryan Santoro, the fullback, is the lone uh, back with Arno. Arno's going to call his own number. Quarterback draw. Big hole. Arno oh, breaks the tackle. Out. Avery Arno will score the runner. Touchdown. Pass. It's been run, run, run. Why not? This time a little, a little collision with O'Connell, but there is some room for O'Connell to run, and O'Connell will run into the end zone! Oh. For a Marauder touchdown! There, there was a huge hole, and he outran everybody. Trout's extra point is up and good, and with 4.17 to go in the first half, wow. this year, 1998, a 29-0 win for the Marauders here at Harris Field. There will not be a shutout for either side today, but there will be... No call hey, on the field. Touchdown! Oh, there it is. First and ten at the Watertown 12. Hand off to Killian O'Connell. Breaking tackles. And Killian O'Connell will score the Marauder touchdown! And ladies and gentlemen, the six-game winning streak of the Watertown Raiders is over. The Belmont Marauders have defeated the Watertown Raiders 33-20 for their first win since 2011 in this series and their fifth win of the season, their best win total in the last five years.